I'm here today as Lord Mayor. The Lord Mayor is the patron of the Impact Award and we're launching the long list today. Uh, so we have 154 titles being launched as part of the long list and the judges, the hard work of the judging starts today. So we have four judges and an independent chair and their job is to start looking at those titles and whittling it down to a short list. At the moment we have eight Irish authors involved. We also have, it's interesting, we have uh, libraries from uh, Africa, we have far down is Cape Town, we have Kenya here and we have Malaysia here, so it's a great spread of, of libraries here and the Irish are more than, we're more than holding our own. To be perfectly honest, the reason I agreed to be a judge or one of the judges of the Impact Award is that I don't read an awful lot of contemporary fiction, particularly international fiction, fiction and translation. So when I was asked would I be interested in reading 154 books, which I get for nothing, it was like all my, all my Christmases came together. So. I was more than happy to, to agree this year because I have the time and uh, I have the interest and I'm very interested in international thought and so on. So uh, it's a great opportunity for me as much as anything else. <coughs> Reading 154 books does seem like an arduous task but I am an avid reader anyway and always have been so I don't approach it like a mountain to be climbed. I read them when I feel like and I read them during the night and I read them in the morning and I read them <coughs> in transit and I read them stationary. So I don't see it, I mean, it wouldn't be fair to the writers in that if you approached it as a, as a, as a task which had to be completed. I, there's, you know, a considerable amount of time between now and the, the shortlist announcement for me to have read and have a pretty clear idea of what I think about the books. I've always been very interested in originality of tone and of style and a view of the world. I think that uh, that would be my particular preference, but remember it's a democratic process and there are a number of people involved and everybody will get a fair shake regardless of what my preferences are. There are 154 books submitted which we'll be reading in the next few months um, and it's a wonderful range, it's from many different countries, different languages, so it's, it's, you know, it'll be tough work but I think it'll be rewarding. It's always an interesting question what judges are looking for and, and very often it's one of those you know when you find it. You're looking for literary excellence. Um, how that manifests itself will vary but, but for books that, that grab you and books that you think will stay with people um, and which really show writing and the novel in the best possible light.